Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another video. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, we're doing a huge Zara haul. So I have these three boxes here, which is going to fall over right now. And I've also got two of the like paper bags that they send out as well now. I basically did a huge order when they had the sale on, so that was like the end of June, start of July kind of time. Um, and then I've ordered a couple more bits since then. But the huge order that I did at the end of June, it didn't just arrive in like one box, it arrived in bits. So yeah, I've got five different packets to show you. And so I'm going to show you what I'm going to be keeping, what I'm going to be sending back. And I'll do some try and clips as well so you can see what the items actually look like on. Um, just for reference, I'm like a size 8 to 10 at the moment and I'm 5 foot 2 so I'm quite short. So some of the items will look um, shorter on other people than me. They are quite long on me and um, just because I'm quite short. So yeah, I did try to order quite a lot of shorts because I want some denim shorts that I can wear in England when it's hot because my shorts that I have, the kind of shorts that I would just wear on holiday and I don't feel like I'm fully dressed if I'm going out in England in them so I don't feel comfortable going to the supermarket in like little shorts. Um, so yeah, I've literally got like one pair of Topshop shorts that I will wear in the summer and then, I mean it's not, not really often that we do get hot weather here so I don't wear them that often. But I just wanted a pair that was just a little bit longer, cover my bum, that I could literally just go into the supermarket in as well if I needed to pop in. Um, and I'm also looking for some more like summer dresses that I want them to be flattering to my figure but then also cover my arms a little bit because I'm not really happy with my arms at the moment. Um, and then not too long so you know nice and shapely but with a bit of a sleeve so yeah I'm struggling to find one at the moment. Uh, if you've got any ideas of where I can find a dress like that then let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, I did order some dresses and shorts and some other bits and bobs that I've seen. Um, there's a bag in here, there's a hat and yeah, a variety of other sale bargains. So yeah, some of it's sale, some items are at full price. Um, I just did the big order together. So yeah, so if you do like this kind of video and you're interested to see the items I got from Zara, then please keep watching. Also give this video a thumbs up and also hit subscribe. I will be doing some more of these soon. Um, it's been quite a long time since I've actually done a fashion haul on YouTube. I tend to do my fashion more on Instagram. But yeah, hopefully we'll do some more of these really soon. So let's dive into these boxes. So I'm going to start with one of the smaller ones first. Okay, so the first item I picked up is actually a top. So like I said, I wasn't really shopping for tops, um, I was more looking for dresses and shorts. But I saw a cute top and I thought, I like that, so I bought this. So this is the top here. So it's almost like elasticated all the way around, so it's like super clingy. But, you know, it will stretch a lot, so yeah. So yeah, it will stretch um, if you do have bigger boobs, obviously this is not an issue for me. But yeah, it's got these cute little sleeves that just sort of sit here. Um, really, really nice pattern, nice summery colours. Let's give you a bit of a close up. So as you can see, it's like super, super stretchy. It's a little bit see through. Um, I picked this up in a size small. This was $27.99. I can't remember which of these were in the sale and which were full price. So if it was in the sale, I'll pop a little price here um, to show you what I actually paid for it. But yeah, $27.99. Um, I don't mind paying more for Zara tops because they are good quality, so they will last longer. But I thought that would look really cute with a pair of denim shorts. The one of 27 pairs that I bought in this uh, order. Um, so yeah, I just picked it up to go with the shorts. Um, I do think it's a little bit big for me, so I'm probably going to be sending this back. It's just got too much stretch in it, and it just doesn't really sit right on me. Um, so yeah, it's not really, it's not really the top I thought it would be when I put it on. But yeah, it is a shame because I do really like these colours. I mean, as you can see from the try on clip, yeah, it's just not really for me this one. So that one's going to go back. So next up is one of the dresses that I bought. So this one, this was kind of like a throw on dress that I can just pop on when it's really hot because obviously it's been quite hot recently in the UK. Um, I just wanted something I can just throw on and just be comfortable in. So I saw this one, a plain looking dress, um, it's got a bit of a frill hem um, and yeah the sleeves are just kind of like waterfall. I thought they would be really nice because I thought it would just cover my arm and just look nice. It's kind of like, it feels like a linen -y material. I'm not very good at describing things. Don't know the material, I can tell you. It's quite uh, lightweight and it's a little bit see-through. So yeah, I thought this would be really nice. It's a little bit too long, as you can see from the clip here. Um, yeah, a little bit too long, a little bit too floaty. It just doesn't really do anything for me. It just kind of hangs and it is incredibly see-through. So yeah, even if I had like a nude or white underwear on, which I wear most of the time if I'm wearing something you know, quite see-through, 
can still see everything. So yeah, that's a shame. So this wasn't for me. This I did get in a size extra small as well, and it was twenty seven ninety nine. I think this was in the sale. I can't really remember. But yeah, I mean, what you can see, I'll see through it is there. So yeah, I wasn't really a fan, but that was a shame because I thought that would be just be a nice like throw on kind of dress, uh, you know, for just popping out back on with a nice pair of sandals. Um, yeah, that was unfortunately a no. Uh, they did have different colours in that as well. So yeah, if that was going to fit nicely, I would have got other colours, but it was a no. Okay, the next one, I went for a bit of a different style. So obviously I've said I'm looking for dresses to like cover my arms. This doesn't cover my arms, but I thought this was so cute. I thought I'm going to try it and see what it looks like. So this is the dress that I picked up next. So it's got like these two straps at the top um, and then it's kind of got it's kind of like one piece of material here then it's kind of a little bit elasticated around the middle so that'll sit like meant to be just under your boobs um, and then it just comes out I can't really describe it I don't know and then the back of it so these two pieces at the back you probably see better from the try on clip this is what the back looks like so as you can see these two pieces here just come on the back and you can tie them in a bow on the back I just think that it's so so nice it's like a perfect summer dress and um, the straps are elasticated as well so obviously they're not adjustable but elasticated so if you did need them longer they should be fine um, and the back is elasticated too like really really elasticated so it's super comfy um, yeah this one didn't look right either so as you can see from the clip yeah it just didn't really fit right I felt like the elastic didn't sit on the right part of my body as it should do and yeah it just felt like a little bit big but a little bit tight at the same time on the middle so this was a size small this was 27.99 so again i think that's a really really good price for this dress like if that fitted that'd just be so nice i just really really like it and i love the pattern as well it's just really it's summery but yeah it just didn't look right didn't fit right so that was another one that was a no so so we're not doing too good so far are we so that was the first little box and i went to the second little box this was a bit of a, a last minute kind of order um so in this one so i actually picked up this cap so it's kind of like a tie-dye nudie ecruy kind of beige color this is just definitely a bit of me i wear a hat every single time i leave the house unless it's hair wash day so if i'm just like bobbing to the shops i just whack my cap on if i've french wiped my hair and put a hair mask on pop my cap on and yeah leave the house and no one can see what your hair looks like it's great so if I don't want to do my hair before going out, pop a hat on and out I go. So I do have quite a few caps. Um, most of them are black or dark colours. Um, because I never want to get like this bit full of makeup, sun cream or anything like that. So I do tend to go for darker ones. But when I saw this, I thought that is so, so nice. So yeah, I picked that up. It is adjustable at the back as well. As you can see. Uh, this is like a one size, I think. Oh no, small to medium. Yeah, small to medium, so I'm guessing they did also uh, medium to large, possibly. Uh, so this says $25.99. This was definitely in the sale. I remember this being in the sale. I think it was maybe $9.99 or $14.99. I'll pop the price here. Um, but yeah, that was really, really affordable. Um, obviously going to cut out this very long label. I mean, do we even need that? Why is it so long? Um, but yeah, I just love that. Definitely a bit of me. And... I have got a lot of um, new clothes from Angel Collection recently and they've all been like neutral colours so this is going to go perfectly with all of those new clothes as well. So yeah, very happy with that so I will be keeping that one, so like the first thing I'm keeping. And then the second item I got in the second box is actually a bag. Now first of all, this is how it came in this gorgeous little material like dust bag. So this is great just to keep it in, in the wardrobe and it's not going to get adjust it um, or anything on it and this is the bag so it's all packaged up still I'll open it up in a second it is so so soft so it's kind of like this pleated material on the front and the back and then the side has this gorgeous like gold hardware really really pretty and then a gold zip okay so I've just taken all the packaging off that so this is the strap that it comes with so as you can see, closer to the bag, we've got the lovely gold coloured chain hardware like this. And then it does go back into the, the black strap as well. The strap doesn't seem to be adjustable um, and it doesn't seem to be detachable either, um, which I don't mind at all because these kind of bags I do wear as crossbody all the time. Um, 
I suppose if you did want to use it as a clutch bag, you could just, you know, unzip it and pop the strap in there and just have the strap in the bottom of the bag. Now inside, we don't really have a pocket as such. We've got the Zara logo here, but on this side, we do have space to pop a couple of cards in there, which is really handy because I don't know about you, but I don't actually use a purse anymore. I literally just have my cards that I need. Um, and yeah, they normally go in the pocket of my bag. So that's going to be really, really handy to pop. Three, well there's three spaces for cards but you can probably fit more than one in each and it's a really really nice size as well so it's definitely enough size for phone makeup cards you know bits and bobs hand sanitizer and mask at the moment um but yeah i just thought that was really really nice so this is it says it's a size medium it's just like a one size bag though isn't it and this doesn't actually have a price on the tag so i think this was 19.99 um i'll double check and pop the price here but yeah, £20, I thought that was a bargain for this bag. You can see how it is on the try on clip as well. You can see where it just sits on the body when you do have it as a crossbody bag. Alternatively, you can just have it placed on your shoulder. Um, and yeah, you can see how it falls there. But it's just such a nice bag. It looks really expensive. It feels so, so soft. And I just thought this was perfect. Just a very everyday bag. And also a bag that you can dress up and dress down. Great for holidays. Great for from going out. And yeah, I just loved it. So this is definitely a bag I'm gonna keep. So we've got two items that I'm keeping so far. No dresses or shorts yet, but we're doing all right. And obviously we've got the little dust bag that we can keep as well. Okay, the next item is a dress. And I had my eye on this dress for a few weeks before the sale, um, before I even knew there was, there was gonna be a sale. And I just thought it looked so, so nice. It's the kind of dress where it had a little bit of a sleeve. So I thought, great, it's gonna cover my arms. It looked like it was elasticated around the waist as well and it just looks so so nice it was like the perfect summer dress so when i knew there was going to be a sale and i was going to do a big order just waited and then just ordered it all together i got this a size small it was 29.99 and this is the dress so that's what the top it looks like and then the bottom does have this cute little frill it's so so nice um this is a picture of it on the model on the website and I just thought this is like the perfect summer dress for me. So it was out of stock for ages and I never know whether to order an extra small or a small or even a medium in Zara. Like the sizes can just be so off. So I waited and I ordered a small. Yeah, so I thought I'd see what a small was like on me. Uh, I didn't want it to be too tight, so I thought a small would be fine. Um, however, I'll show you the try and clip here. It's just so, so big on me. Like it's really baggy. So obviously this is elasticated. It's like the same material as the top at the start. It's just really, really stretchy, which is great, super comfortable, but it's so, so big. And it just, yeah, it's massive. Um, I absolutely love the sleeves. This, these are the sleeves, it's like embroidery. And they just hang so, so nice. They're really, really pretty. Um, I absolutely love the color. It has these hidden buttons as well in the neckline. So obviously it's a very low V-neck, so you can wear it very low if you want to but it does have these elasticated like button holes and then the buttons are just on the other side of it. So you can fasten that to have it a little bit more hidden um, and done up. And obviously you don't see the buttons any either, which is really, really nice. But yeah, it's just too big. So I don't know whether to send it back and order the extra small when that comes back in stock um, or just not to bother. But yeah, I just thought it was so nice. So that, it just sits perfectly on my waist as well, but it's just so, so big on the top. This is what the back looks like. It's quite plain on the back. It's just elasticated. And then, yeah, it just comes out the bottom. But I do really, really like it. It's just too big and just too stretchy. So yeah, like I said, this was 29.99. I can't remember if it was in the sale. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna have to send that one back just because it's just too big. Um, and yeah, when it comes back in stock, I might reorder it. Let me know what you think about this one um, and whether I should reorder it in a smaller size because I do really, really like it. Okay, next I have another dress. Like I said, I'm on the hunt for some dresses. Uh, this one is more like a tea dress. So this is what it looks like. So it looks like at the bottom. It's a very, very plain like tea dress kind of style. Um, but I just thought it was really, really pretty. Um, I do have a similar one to this from Motel Rocks. And I love it. It's just a little bit on the small side at the moment. Um, it did fit me before lockdown, but just a little bit tight. Um, and I don't really want to be wearing like super tight clothes when it's so hot. So um, yeah, I just thought I would try a different dress. So this is the print. I'll show you a close up. Really, really pretty. Um, I got this in a size small and it was 27 99 So that previous dress was also small and it was massive. Um, so after I tried that one on, I tried this one on and it's so, so tight. So the top is like a v-neck. 
you'll see better on the try on clip but yeah it's a v-neck at the top and then all the way down it does have these hidden buttons again so just like on the other one it's got the elasticated little loops there um, and then little material buttons like this um, so yeah it does have buttons all the way down um, but it does still leave a bit of a v-neck there um, now it comes in at the waist in fact I don't even know if I'll be able to do a try and clip for this because it's just so so tight it comes in at the waist and it's not like stretchy at all and it's just so so tight so I can fasten the elasticated buttons but you know when like your buttons are too tight and it kind of gapes and there's a bit of a hole that's what it's like around the like stomach area so like below my chest and yeah it's just so tight like the top of it's fine the bottom of it's fine the sleeves are fine but then the middle's like and that's a size small so yeah I think if I sized up and went for a medium it'd be fine around the waist but too big around the chest area and on the shoulders so this is just a no like I said a small is too small medium is going to be too big I don't know what size it should be that's the back it's just a very plain back but yeah that was a shame because I just thought I really like this one again yeah not doing too well with the dresses so far I've got a bag and a hat next I picked up just a plain white t-shirt it's a bit of a boxy kind of t-shirt and it's just got a bit of a dip hem at the back very very plain I got this because I do have a lot of t-shirts I do wear t-shirts a lot um but I don't really have any white ones anymore I just don't know where they've gone I think when they've just been a bit discoloured I've just got rid of them so I do have a lot of blacks and greys and neutrals and peaches um, but yeah I just thought I want a white t-shirt for the summer I just thought it looks really nice this I got in a size small because I thought I don't want it to be too tight I've not had just a plain t-shirt from Zara before um, kind of like one of the essentials so I went for a size small because I thought if it's a bit big it doesn't really matter it's just a t-shirt this was 11 .99. I don't think this was in the sale um, yeah very plain t-shirt with a crew neck on the sleeves and yeah you can't go wrong with a t-shirt so I'm gonna keep this one so so far I have a cap t-shirt and a bag that I didn't need um but no dress or short okay next I got another dress I was so excited for this one it looks so nice so I ordered this and I got it in a size small it was 27.99 this is what it looks like so again here's the label it's got a v-neck and it's got these cute little puffy sleeves now I was a little bit concerned about this bit because it's elasticated um, so I don't really want it to dig in my arms um, but I do really like the puff sleeve I think it's so so cute that's what the top looks like and then it kind of comes out in these like layered ruffles would you say? layers? I don't really know how to describe it but yeah it's like layers I just think it's so so pretty um, it looks like a denim kind of dress uh, it's not denim just like a thick kind of, I don't know, linen-y, cotton-y material. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it feels really nice. It's quite lightweight. You know, it's not too heavy. Um, it's thicker than the other dresses. Um, but I just thought it's such a nice dress for summer. Again, another dress I can just throw on. It's just not for me. I think I'm too short for this one. It just kind of hangs and just looks not very flattering. So yeah, it's also a little bit tight on the arms as well with the elastic. So I will show you a picture or video here um but yeah it's just not for me just doesn't look right and i think if it maybe was a little bit shorter it might look a bit better on me i don't know if it's just because it's like too long on me i'm just too short um or oh yeah if it just doesn't fit so that's a shame but yeah that's such a nice dress um so yeah i got a size small in that did consider an extra small but then i thought it's going to be too tight on my arms and probably stop my circulation so yeah that's going to go back as well, which is a shame. Okay, on to my 27 pairs of shorts I ordered. So, first of all, I'm going to show you the ones that I did actually try on and decide to keep because these are really, really nice and I've had so many no's so far in this video. I'm going to show you what yeah. With the shorts, I ordered quite a few and I ordered a few different styles and I ordered them, quite a lot of them, in an 8 and a 10. Um, cause I, thought, I don't really know what size they are, I'm in Zara, I've not bought pants since my last Zara haul which was last year and I ended up, I think, did I get a small or a medium in those leather trousers, I can't remember but yeah, I've no idea what size they are. Um, so these are high rise dad short um, and I got them in an 8 and a 10 and these are the ones I'm keeping. I absolutely love them. 
So I did decide to keep these in an eight. That's what they look like. I absolutely love the kind of washed out denim look. And I think when you get a tan in the summer as well, it just looks so, so nice with the tan. Um, just because it's like a really, really light acid wash. And then we've got the frayed distressed hemp as well. And yeah, I absolutely love them. I think they're so, so nice. So I tried both of these on and I decided on the 8. Uh, the 10 was absolutely massive, so I'm definitely not a 10. Um, the 8 and these fit really nicely, so I will show you a clip of those here to show you how nice they fit. And yeah, I'll definitely be keeping these. Now these come, as you can see from the video, like just below my bum. So pushing it a little bit for getting away with it in the UK, um, in my opinion, and what I feel comfortable in. Um, but definitely a pair of shorts that I will take on holiday. Uh, year after year and I just absolutely love them Um I will still wear these ones in the UK I think they're absolutely fine and yeah I just think with a nice t-shirt I just think they'll look really really nice I just love the colour so nice so yeah so keeping those in an 8 and I'm sending the 10 back because they were huge more shorts so this next pair these are called mum shorts I will leave the item numbers and maybe some links uh, in the description down below if you do want to check any of these out if any of these are for you so I did get these ones in an 8 and a 10 these are the mum shorts a bit misshapen at the moment so they do have the distressed hem as well very free very distressed I do really like the style um, and then this is the back so as you can see they do come down like quite a lot lower the, a lot longer than the other ones um, so definitely well covered up for England um, but the 8 was actually too tight around my waist and the 10 was too big so I'm um, obviously a size 9 in these shorts in Zara which obviously they don't do um, but yeah and the colour so this is kind of like a light blue colour but you know you can see the difference and I just prefer the lighter shade definitely prefer the acid wash um, rather than this one they do look really really nice um, and I do like the picture on the model as well I love how the pockets are at the top as well and then another pair this is the this is the size 8 of this one so this is similar to the ones I've just shown you these are high rise shorts and I love the finish on these so another slightly longer pair these are similar in length to the previous pair so obviously longer than the pair I'm keeping this is what the back looks like. I just thought they were so nice. Really, really nice colour. Absolutely love them. Um, but again, eight's too small, ten's too big. So, yeah, not for me at the moment, I'm afraid. But so nice. Okay, and the final pair of denim shorts I picked up, which again are going back, are these high rise shorts. Again, really, really nice. I love the finish on these as well. So, so pretty. That's what the back looks like. I love how it's kind of like the cut off design at the bottom. And you can see obviously where it's been uh, dyed as well. I just really, really like these. However, I put these on, went to fasten them, and they have four buttons as a fastening. I can't be faffing with four buttons when I'm hot. I need just a zip and a button at the top. So yeah, these were a little bit snug, these size 8. The snugness combined with four buttons just meant it was a bit of a no for me. Um, but they, yeah, they are really, really nice. I do love this pair. Um, but I mean, especially when I've got nails on as well, when it's so hot, trying to get down to that bottom button to fasten it or unfasten it to get them off. It's just a bit of a faff. And then the final pair of shorts that I actually picked up, um, a little bit different. I did see these on someone, I think it was a YouTube video or Instagram, I can't remember. Um, and I absolutely love the picture on the model. So these are the Bermuda shorts. I absolutely love these. I love the colour, I love the style, I love the design. They've got like the stitching it down the front and they also have pockets as well, which is amazing. So the lines on the back aren't actually pockets, they are fake pockets, but I think it looks really, really nice anyway. Um, and the fastening is just a zip. And that is covered by that piece of material there and then inside we do have a button as well just to keep it um, closed and I just thought they were absolutely stunning perfect for summer perfect if I'm going for a meal um, or going out on holiday you know if you're dressing up nicely for an evening meal I thought they were so nice they are quite thick um, and they are quite heavy but if I'm going to wear these I'd probably wear them with like a little crop top so so that's not really a problem I'm just obsessed with these I think they look so nice so smart 
but yeah, dress these up with a little crop top and a pair of wedges or a pair of heels. I think it's going to look so nice. So I'm definitely keeping these. So these were, I got them in a size small and these were $19.99 and they fit perfectly. So yeah, an extra small would have been way too small. Okay, nearly at the end. So the next thing I picked up was this fine knit kind of jumper t-shirty kind of thing. Um, it, so it is knitted. It's like a fine knit. It's very like see-through. Very, very thin. Um, this is so, so soft. So it's obviously got the round neck. It does come quite high up. Um, and then the sleeves, you know, it does cover your arms a little bit, just comes um, just above the elbow. And then it does have the little hem at the bottom as well. Um, it's really, really stretchy. It's so, so soft. I got this in a size small and it was $19.99. Uh, if it was sale, I'll put the price there. I can't remember. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was really nice for like something smart, even like going to work or something. Uh, I thought I could pop this on with uh, a pair of black jeans or trousers. Um, it is really see-through, so if I was wearing it like to the office, I'd have to put something under it. So I also picked up this little crop top. This is so pretty. Um, the model on the website was wearing it with denim shorts, and it just looks so nice. So I thought, I want this to go with my shorts. Um, yeah, it's this little crop top here. Close up. It's so, so nice. Um, so yeah, I'd wear this on its own uh, with denim shorts in the summer or on holiday. Um, it's really, really stretchy. So, so comfy and I absolutely love the lining as well. Obviously that is a little bit see-through. Um, I'd wear a nude bra under that. The strap is also adjustable, which is great. So I picked this up in a size small. Again, I didn't know what size to get, extra small, small, so I did a small, um, and it was 17 99 I think it's so, so pretty. And then when I tried this on, I just popped this over the top. It just goes so well. So it's just a little something underneath it, so obviously it's not completely see-through. Um, but it just goes so well with it and it doesn't look out of place. So yeah, $19.99 and $17.99. So I'm keeping both of those. And then the final item was another item I thought I could wear this for work when it gets a little bit colder. And it's this black jumper. So it's a little bit kind of short in the body with long sleeves. It does have the cuff around the sleeves. Um, also a cuff around the waist. And then it's very, very high neck as you can see does come up really really high and it's incredibly stretchy so obviously that looks tiny um, but yeah obviously stretches over your head and what's a bit different about this one as well is it has shoulder pads in like this as you can see it just gives it a little bit more shape and honestly I don't think I'm gonna put the triangle club on it because yeah it's just really really not for me it looks so strange Um, it just doesn't sit right on my shoulders it just doesn't suit me Um, it is quite short in the body and yeah it's just not really for me it's very tight around my neck um, and I, yeah, I just feel a little bit claustrophobic to be honest. Um, I did get this in a size medium and it was $19.99. This was so, so tight around my neck though. I'm wondering if I should have got like a large, but then I don't know how big it would look kind of like around the chest area um, and the sleeves. But yeah, I thought it was okay on the website. I thought I'm doing an order anyway. Like I wouldn't have ordered this on its own, but because I was doing an order, um, I just threw it in my basket as well. And yeah, tried it out, but it's just not for me. So that was everything that I picked up from Zara. Um, half success, I would say. So I did pick up, and I'm keeping, uh, the pair of denim shorts. So these were the High Rise Dad shorts, and these were 19.99. I did also get the Bermuda shorts um, in a size small. They were also 19.99. Um, and then I'm keeping the crop top and the fine knit jumper, so that was $19.99 and $17.99. And then of course we've got the cap, which $25.99, but I think that was sale. The plain white t-shirt, which was $11.99. And then the final item was this bag. And I can't remember the price of that one, I'll pop it on the screen. Didn't manage to get any dresses, which is a shame. Um, but I will keep looking and hopefully they'll bring some more out. So thank you so much for watching guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and also hit subscribe. Um, if you do have any comments on the items, if you've got any suggestions of dresses I can try, then let me know in the comments down below and I will reply to them as well. And yeah, thanks again for watching and I'll see you in another video.